Here's a Morgan Alto mouthpiece. It's marked 5M. It doesn't say jazz on it, but it, it might be. It's kind of a slimmer uh, looking, you know, design. Um, it was dropped probably years ago. Client just got gotten around to uh, sending it to me, but the, um, you know, you can see where this corner here is dented in and there's a little lip. The material has been pushed this way. And rather than just trimming that off, I'm going to take a shot at using a little bit of heat to see if we can pull out some of the material. So um, I'm heating up um, a light bulb over here. And we're going to give this a shot. Let's see what we can do. Let's see if we get a little little bit of uh, movement on the material. It's, you know, nothing ventured, nothing gained. It'll either move somewhat on its own, or I may have to coax it a little bit. Yeah, and this may make the facing crooked, but we're going to have to do some, some work on it anyhow if we use epoxy to fix it, so... Yeah, it might be moving with some. Yeah, you know, the client said they contacted me 10 years ago, so this could be a 10-year-old or more piece of damage. I've seen, like, you know, little dents taken this way moved out by this kind of idea with this big corner dent is kind of a different animal. I'll probably just get part of it out. I guess what I want to do next is kind of get a a tool to maybe push it a little as it You know, it's hard rubber, so it's not plastic. It doesn't necessarily move the same, but. Okay, let's take a look and see what we ended up with. I had zoomed this camera in a little bit. But I would say that's progress. You know, I don't know if I'll get it all out, but definitely the lip is not even there, you know. Um, so I smoothed, you know, the amount of material that was folded over is pushed back into it. And um, I may even get away with just facing this out rather than having to use any epoxy at all. So I may try it again. Um, but, yeah, there's some progress. Okay, third segment. You know, I had heated both the tool and the mouthpiece and, you know, got it pressed to where I'm going to leave it now. Took three shots at it. And, um, yeah, it's going to need facing, facing work to get the rest away, but doesn't need any epoxy in my opinion. So, like, if I throw up at 49, it, it's a little, little high on the left. 63, it's a little high on the left. But, uh... If I go back to 37, yeah, it's a little high there too. So uh, I am going to have to skim the entire facing, but it's it's not it's fairly fairly even and just a little higher on this side. So that that'll re repair pretty good. Yeah. Mm, trying to focus. Ship this out. 